Around three months ago, I made a video on the best cooking channel on YouTube, The Short Cook, and basically made fun of it. Now we're going to be doing it a second time. So we've got some more recipes we're going to be looking at. Wild garlic and nettle-ish soup. I'm intrigued by the contents of this video, this vlog, this this video blog. Uh huh. Today, what we're going to make is some nettle soup. Are we doing the short cook vlog? Why is he out in the open? Cooks go outside. Nettle soup. Nettle soup. Yeah, because I love that pain of nettles going down my throat. Yeah, I just love that. Yeah, I maybe die from it from loss of blood and internal bleeding, but who cares? It's soup made by the short cook. Eat it, or it's a personal insult. We are gonna show you the marvels <clears throat> of... I hate how he coughs every five seconds. The marvels. <laughs> <laughs> the transitions never fail to entertain. <laughs> Oh, is it Clive? Is Clive still editing and recording the videos? I love Clive. He made it back unscathed. The nettles try to attack him. And his dog. We are still the short cook. We are still wearing the shorts. Still Unsc just under six foot. There we go. It wouldn't be a short cook video if he didn't reference the fact that he was, he was an actor in, in Snow White. Uh, and dedications today. Okay, so I got really offended first time where it what I was not dedicated, so dedication please. Ben Welsh for being the number one subscriber. I am the number one subscriber. I made a whole video on you. I gave you recognition. I actually checked and you gained, what, like 20 subscribers since I made that video in the three month period? And you haven't uploaded for a, like a full on year. So, you know. Hello? Get out of the frame, you little bit. Let's go over here, Clive. <clears throat> he's talking to Clive like he's the dog. Come on, come on, come on, put the camera over there, quick, quick. Unless I, f until I fire you. Do it, do it. You're not getting paid, but do it. Right, what we've got here is we've pre-cooked the soup. So what that looks disgusting, the short cook. Look at it. Look at it. What are the what are the bits in it? And the main stars of the show today. Uh, we turned those, the wild nettles. Oh, they're the nettles. Okay, hey guys, the short cook here. Today we're going to be doing a challenge. How, how, how much nettles can we eat in one minute? Um, no one cares if I die. It's a try not to die challenge. Right. We are going to. That looks absolutely disgusting. It really does. The short cook, you have failed us all. Resign. And, uh... Voila. A little bit like... You've already put nettles in it. You've already put plants in it. And now you're putting plants all over it. It's, uh, Whitey. Right at the end there. I'm not sure if anybody caught... I would nuke that house. We are still the short cook. We are still wearing the shorts. <laughs> Viewing area. The viewing area. <laughs> it's like, like you've got a shrine of all your, all, all your creations. Like this is the viewing platform. Only the short cook may go onto it. Can you get any more closer, Clive? I need to smell it. So that's a. Has it been the short out from the short cook? Short out for me tonight. <laughs> yes. Thank you. That was not long enough to make a full video. We need to watch another one. A banana and chocolate bread and butter pudding-ish. Today we are going to do bread and butter pudding-ish with a slight twist on there. In the yeah, we're going to be not using chocolate and I think, <laughs> I think you know what we will be using. And he says he got to that size eating chips and pies. Cooking chocolate of any description as long as it's a high cacao mix. Um, cacao mix. You certainly know your chocolate, the short cook. I wonder why. Go on the top, we're gonna have to find some. You need to be paid more, Clive. Even if it's like a thousand pounds every video, you need to be paid more. That is torture. Visual and audio. That is disgusting. You reckon we can do this without making a disaster? It's no, it's gonna go all over the floor. Then you're gonna blame Clive for it and then he's gonna get fired. He's gonna have to move to America and change his identity. He can't go within 10 meters. You're gonna have to get a restraining order. He's gonna go mad. There's gaps in between. We'll just work that through. 
Probably need to go back over it in a minute and put some more in there. You have the option here of doing the chocolate orange. You need to do the chocolate orange. You made the chocolate mousse last time. That tasted like a chocolate orange. Why can't you make that the signature dish? Seriously, I would go to the Shot Cook Hotel. <laughs> where every single dish is made by yours truly and it it, it it will be divine it will be chocolate all the time and you'll still and you know he'll still say he's got to that size eating chips and pies you liar pudding but since we did the chocolate orange mousse the other day we thought we'd have a go at something else well it's just plain chocolate that and that isn't adding any flavor a few or any change so you might as well add there. the orange why is he like placing them like so or something just use other fruit, undoubtedly. it's it's gonna be submerged anyways who cares it's probably gonna move within all right please don't put the chocolate all over it because that looks nice already all right you don't need to add all that so once again in there, we've got the cream, the melted chocolate. Got the creme fraiche. Sugar and egg mix. Make sure that's Please all don't. Together in there. Please, for the sanity of your own viewers. Effectively a chocolate custard. No, it's chocolate. Why on the bread? What are you doing that for? Uh, that. No, that, that, no, you've ruined it. Look at it. That looks disgusting. Stop pouring it. Get a lot firmer than it is now. It should sort of set up. Okay, fine. As long as it looks good. Get that's the final that. thing. We need to sprinkle some sugar over the top. As if oh yeah, we need to add the short cook there. signature. This is not for the slimmers. La 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 la. I don't Just care. What is the slightest bit of sugar the supposed to do to it? Enough. Anyway, and then what we're going to do with that is. Burn it. Like, I'm visually displeased at this whole thing. Take two, Clive. Take two. Take two. Okay, so Transition again. Let's see it. As you can see, we've got some. That actually looks nice. I'm not even joking, but the sides just look too chocolatey. Quite caramelized bits here. Why? You didn't add any caramel in it, you idiot. In, uh, one of these rings, like a Why? Use a knife! It's not, it's a... It's not like dough, where you need to get the most out of each roll, you know? It's finished. Cut it up. What? Ooh, oh. The chocolate has not set or anything. It is still liquidy at the bottom. He can't believe his eyes. Even Clive, the underpaid cameraman is mocking him. It wasn't quite our way, yeah. <laughs> it wasn't quite our way I've got, I've got to say. Huh? What's that for? That was... Why are you adding a chocolate bar at the top? You fool! You call yourself a cook, you do, you do whatever you damn well please. You have an addiction, the shock cook. Look, just, just look how much chocolate itself is in that dish. And yet, and yet it's just normal banana and butter. <coughs> Eat it. Yeah. So, shot out. There we have it. Uh, chocolate say, bread and butter pudding. -ish. Don't say shot That's out. Say shot out from the shot cook. Please subscribe. Let's just watch a few seconds of this one, and then we'll end the video. Look at the camera, you fool! And welcome to the short chef. Uh... The short chef. No, -uh, no, it's the short cook. Are you an imposter? I'm done. I'm sorry. I can't do it. The short chef! <laughs>